Shalom friends, let's do a makeup tutorial for the holiday of Shavuot. Start with a human face. Clip your hair back so you can pick up sheaves in the field of Boaz. If you're going to stay up all night studying Torah, you do need eyeshadow primer, unless your minhag is creasing. Of course, in all the commandments given in Mount Sinai, the most important is thou shalt blend. I'm using grain colors, not gold. We don't want to remind God of the golden calf. Grain. The mountain was smoky and so is this look. Jewish lore holds that the tablets of the law were made out of sapphire, so I'm going to put some blue shimmer up in here. Line with waterproof pencil and felt tip liner. This look should last as long as one needs to wander in the desert. Mascara so you can bat your eyes at someone you met at Sinai. Skin tint with sunscreen. Protect yourself while harvesting. Come on. You want to preempt the bags you're going to have under your eyes from studying all night. Preempt it. Put on some long-lasting cheek stain like you're shy about sneaking in to lay at Boaz's feet on the threshing floor. Setting spray and a Jewish star formation. Fan yourself like you're all those wings Ezekiel saw. And then fan yourself because Boaz noticed you. When Moses came down the mountain from FaceTiming God, he was terrifyingly radiant. And we're going to emulate that look with so much highlighter, it's disturbing. Line your lips and use the same long-lasting lip color. Spray your face to lock it down to last the 40 days Moses was up there freaking everybody out. And you are all set to go receive the Torah or Boaz. Chag Sameach.